Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video Coinbase wallet users in this guide We are exploring how to add a custom token to your coinbase wallet in 2024 Whether you are holding unique crypto assets or participating in token sales Stay tuned as we cover the steps to add custom tokens to your coinbase wallet. So guys, let's get started So before we start with this video make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information so guys normally in coinbase to add a crypto to your coinbase wallet there is few methods normally the first method is basically by buying that cryptocurrency so go to the asset tab select the buy button and select assets to add enter desired amounts and source of funds then preview and confirm you can buy crypto directly from within coinbase wallet using various payment methods such as bank account local payment method or car payment in more than 130 countries there's also transferring transferring crypto you can transfer crypto directly from your coinbase account to your coinbase wallets by linking your account if you select the buy button you will be prompt to log into your coinbase account and from there you can see which crypto is available to be moved to your wallet Let's choose the coin and enter the desired amount and you are all set. There is also imports wallet. So if you have another self custody wallet, you can easily merge it with your Coinbase wallet. Prior to login in your, uh, you will see two options, create a new wallet and I already have a wallet. If you click on I already have a wallet, you will be prompt to enter your existing wallet 12 word recovery phrase and it will be automatically be promoted into Coinbase wallet. So these are the normal ways of actually adding or that's basically adding crypto to your Coinbase wallet. Uh, but the problem here is that the fact that Coinbase doesn't support every single uh, like coin. So in case you would like to buy cryptocurrency, I would go here, buy, all right. But still, you wouldn't even find here BNB. What's about your custom token? So here we are talking about something that is impossible to do by buying it or by following the usual steps. So in this video, I'm going to show you the step that I have discovered recently about making this happening. So the first thing is, is this token is basically on a public network the public network what i mean the level one network or the layer one network the layer one networks are basically like uh, ethereum bitcoin bnb uh, polygon etc so here are you on the first layer network or not if not then you have to go through the layer two networks and side chains so Coinbase wallet allows you to transfer tokens and from to and from layer two networks and side chains such as Polygon, Arbitrum, and Base. So here they are, uh, layer one networks uh, like Bitcoin or Ethereum. Layers two are designed to enhance the speed and reduce the cost of performing. So for example, there is uh, Lava Chain or uh, there is like Arbitrum and Base. And yeah, this is basically level two. Basic normally, usually you would be on layer two if you have made your own network. So uh, how you can add this is basically. Uh, something very hard but how to add it it's simply by going there are a lot of lesser known but still EVM compatible networks that also offer similar scalability solution to popular L2 networks Coinbase wallet allows you to add a customer network RPC in order to transact on the designed designate des uh, designed uh, network so to add custom network on the Coinbase wallet mobile app, you have to select the settings, select active DAP network or default network on the Coinbase wallet extension. So this is only gonna work on the extension. So make sure guys that you have the extension or the app, both of them do the same thing, but make sure that you are on the extension. This is the most important thing. Then three, select the plus button or this plus symbol on the top right of your screen, C uh, complete signature uh, design set fields, which are usually provided in a developer guide or doc of the network in question. Once completed, select a network and it should be added. This is an example. 
so as you can see here appearance team color etc you will find here the active dap network then click on it in case you wasn't going to use ethereum there will be all the list of other networks that you can use in case the the network that you were looking for is here this is perfectly good in case it wasn't simply click on this plus button that will take you to a page where you can add a custom network just put the information needed you, uh, with the information i mean the rpc url chain id currency symbol and the block explorer url if it is uh, necessary uh, for for our case here it is optional then click on add network and it should be added right after that it's still not gonna work for you you still have the network but you wouldn't be able to buy any tokens that have uh, in this network if they are not supported by Coinbase at the first place so here we are talking about a custom network so custom or custom basically uh, custom token so custom tokens can be usually added to other wallets such as MetaMask so what do I do usually I go to MetaMask. I do this like that. I go to MetaMask. I download it for Chrome. Add to Chrome, as you can see, and add extension. So right after I do that, I simply create my account very fast. Um, it shouldn't take that much or that long of a time. So let's go here. It should be added. And here it is. So here, what you have to do is to create your account very, very quickly. I agree. Just type whatever password. There we go, another password, understand, and create wallet. Like that we have created our wallet and got it. So what you have to do now is, for example, I am on Ethereum main network, I'm going to go and add a new network, let's add for example BNB, approve, and now I am on the BNB network. Let's say that there is a custom like token uh, that is on the BNB network. I will simply click on import tokens. And I should add here the token contract address. So what I usually do simply, for example, if the coin was listed in PooCoin, which are basically the worst tokens in the world can be posted here. So let's simply just say, for example, Titan. And yeah, there is, for example, this Titano, which is normally wouldn't be, for example, accepted here. Holy, what is this? All right. <laughs> All right. I don't suggest you guys to go for it, but here it is. This is the token. So I'm going to copy it. I'm going to my MetaMask and I'm going to import it. I'm going to link here the token address. Oh, my bad. Uh, nope, not like that. Uh, can I copy it, please? All right. Let's copy this. And now, yep, it is working now. So what I'm going to do is to do it like that. Saitano, next and import and now it has been imported so usually what i will do is to buy the titan token so i will buy it through uh, for example a pool coin and then what i'm gonna do is to send it i'm going to send it to my wallet on coinbase so this is the only way possible for me to send and add token custom to my Coinbase wallet so yeah guys that was it for today's tutorial if you enjoyed it make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel if you have any more questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section and see you guys in the next tutorial